How you doing? Uh, we have a protective order for you. We need to read you. Are you uh, Mr. I don't answer any questions. Okay. We just need to identify you. So how can we identify you? I don't answer any questions, nor do I have identification on me. Okay. Hold on. So can I have your name and badge number, please? Sure. I'm Officer Denny. Do you have a badge number or an ID number? 1590. Can I get your name? No, sir. May I have your name and badge number, please? It's Officer Doyle, 0854. Thank you, Officer Doyle. Can you provide identification? I don't have identification on me. Okay. Are you... Who? Are you... I don't know who that is. Are you the White Rabbit? Do you go by the White Rabbit? I go by the White Rabbit. You do. Okay. I don't know who the first person... Say the first name again. William. William what? Is that your name? My name is William. Okay. But what's the last name? So he's got to serve you on a protective order, okay? Petitioner being Mr. Uh, John Vitokas. The court has ordered, all right, the respondent, that's being, that's you, shall not <clears throat> commit acts of violence, force, or threat, or criminal offenses that may result in injury to person or property. The respondent shall have no contact of any kind with the petitioner. The respondent shall have no contact of any kind with the family or household members of the petitioner. So what if they contact me because they've been actively contacting me? Are they in violation of this protective order? No contact means no texting, emails. If they no calls, are engaged like in a conversation with me. Are they in violation okay. of this you, protection? You order? cannot have any engagement with me. Okay. So if they Just, engage me, hold on. I'm Let's, asking a question. If they engage me, I, am, am I in violation of this order? If you engage back with them, yes. <laughs> so it is also further ordered that the respondent uh, is not to come within a thousand feet of the petitioner. Okay. So you're actively violating the First Amendment right of the free so press. So the issue, uh, Mr. Russell, is uh, that uh, Mr. Trump Again, is, I don't know is, who that name is. is you're present, not saying that name is correctly. Is present here. Okay. Um, so I'm an agent of the press, and you're, you're actively violating the First Amendment. So you're going to be in violation of the protective order. Um, we're going to have to ask you to leave, okay? I am going to provide you with a copy of the protective order today. All right. And will you be in court? Me Over personally, I, I will not. Why not? Unless they subpoena me. Okay, you will All be right. subpoenaed because you are uh, the one also, handling these. Will, will on any this, of you be in court? Also, we will this. Subpoenas. Also, for this, um, we've also provided uh, information as far as uh, firearms as it pertains to protective orders, okay? So any firearms that you have um, within 24 hours, you cannot possess, essentially. That's great because I don't so, own any firearms. Okay. All right, so that's your copy of it. Do you have any questions about this? A ton, but you're not going to answer them, it seems. Okay. Um, so this is to be considered that the protector is served, okay? So from this point on, uh, any violations, um, though this is a uh, civil paper, violations are considered criminal, okay? Do you have any questions? All right. Good luck to you, sir. Thank you, sir. And what was your name and badge number? Sergeant Pulley. 0677 I don't like I don't like people behind me so you can go thank you I'm documenting your vehicles as well okay. I'm an agent of the press and you cannot interfere with my right during an investigation and I am leaving I am also documenting Hello. How are you? Good. May I have your name and badge number, please? Lieutenant Hayes. Thank you, Lieutenant Hayes. You're welcome. Have a great day. You too. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, Major. May I have your name and badge number, sir? May I have your name and badge number, sir? I'm sorry. Mr. Alvis, 0689. Can you repeat that? I'm sorry to scream across the parking lot for you, sir. Alvis, 0689. Thank you, sir. Have a good day, sir. You too. Thank you.